One of the challenges of achieving a good price for a seller in this market is the method of sales we've been using, the uh, private treaty method and the auction method. There are reasons why those two methods aren't doing so well in this market, so I'd like to talk to you about the pros and cons of each of those methods. Firstly, with private treaty, there are challenges in pricing a property. Sometimes us agents, we don't know where a property is going to sell, so we can underprice a property and, and potentially sell it too cheap for an owner. Um, and if we price it too high, we can waste weeks and days on the market and find ourselves in the dead zone, um, which doesn't work in the owner's favour. A weakness of private treaty is the lack of transparency. We are, as agents, not allowed to disclose what other offers are. And being agents, the public do not trust us, unfortunately. We, um, there are surveys out that 93% of the public do not trust us agents and therefore if we say there's multiple offers, put your best offer in, um, buyers generally don't believe us. So that's been a problem with the private treaties, that is the lack of transparency, the lack of uh, honesty out there and unfortunately the dishonesty of agents that say there are multiple offers when there aren't. Um, so that's something to bear in mind with private treaty and, and the problem that we face with it. They may not believe that there are other offers on the table um, and an, an agent may say there's multiple offers but without actually showing them proof buyers are reluctant to offer their best price and so what can happen is a buyer can miss out on purchasing because they were unaware of the price that they needed to beat and far too often us agents we hear of a buyer saying if I had have known what that what the offer was or what that property sold for I would have paid more and so that's something we really don't like hearing as agents because we could have potentially got more for our seller. With auction methods, uh, the terms and conditions are not favourable to a lot of the market. So the auction method excludes a lot of the buyers, the conditional buyers, so subject to finance buyers or buyers that need to sell a home to purchase. Uh, so using the auction method, you can reduce your market substantially by excluding the conditional buyers. One of the advantages of auctions is that people are bidding under competition and through the fear of missing out people can push themselves a little bit further than what they were expecting and obviously achieving that premium price for the seller under competition. We've looked at all the pros and cons on the traditional method of sale and we've been looking at a, another platform, it's an online bidding platform um, that has been bringing excellent results for sellers. The number of days on the market is sitting around about 31 days using this platform as opposed to approximately 70 days with private treaty and there are a lot of um, benefits to the, the new platform. It's, it's a hybrid of all the methods, so it's flexible, term-friendly method of sale that buyers and sellers are giving us great feedback on. Buyers really love it because of the transparency. They can see where other people sit in terms of pricing so they can um, keep improving their position on price up into a level that they see value in the property or up to their borrowing capacity. And sellers are really enjoying it because it brings competition to the table and buyers will always pay a little bit more under competition through the fear of missing out. And as agents, that's what our job is to do, is to bring that premium price to the owner in the shortest time possible.